I want to start it. Start it? Yeah. Start what? What's going on, guys? What's everybody up to? <laughs> 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 what's uh what's everyone doing? <laughs> what's uh Bounds, what's happening, buddy? What's uh what's going on? What are you guys up to? Oh. Sioux City. This wig's not gonna last very long. Hey, long hairs. This is like wow. a, this is tough to deal with. Yeah, happy Halloween, everybody. Halloween. I know we are like twins, isn't that crazy? Or something like that. <laughs> a little bite. Ah, uh, what's up with the 57? Giveaway. Sitting in the driveway. It's waiting to be given away. Aw, oh, thanks, Lunar Outlaw. That's real nice of you. Oh, thanks, buddy. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. <clears throat> Couldn't tell us apart. Come on. Yeah, I want to be back in the garage. <clears throat> Danny's got to toughen up a little bit. It's too cozy inside. I like the warmth. Hey, bro. <laughs> Halloween's canceled. Yeah, same here. We didn't have one kid. Yeah, we didn't have one kid, which I mean it's good because I didn't have any candy. But like, this is better. Yeah, I love it out here. It wasn't all my fault. You wanted to try inside, you know. It wasn't just me. Turns out I was wrong then. Yeah. All my fault. Wrong like usual. Yeah. I'd rather be outside. Well, F me, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so high, I see double. <laughs> you should get that checked out, number one. Man, she really wants that bread. <laughs> nope, no candy tonight. Uh, 56 is going to get a small block. No. We're doing good. How about you? No, no stroop waffle number one. No stroop for us. Oh, we should have got some coveralls for the dog. That would have been very cute. That would have been good. She's just a lumberjack tonight. Yeah. I actually have a matching thing to that. Yeah, I was wearing it today. <laughs> yeah, right. Forgot, John. How about you? Steve's inside. Yeah, green screen, screen the wall. <laughs> cool pup, cool car, cool people. Aw. <clears throat> Our favorite kind of cools. Oh, BW all over. Yeah, I did one rocker today. I still gotta do the other side. <clears throat> it was a pain. It weren't long enough. I had to make a little piece <laughs> right there. Wonder Twin Powers activate! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Osman, what's up, buddy? Now we're behind on the comments. We are. are we? I thought we were doing pretty good here. No, no, uh, no floor yet. I'm going to do the rockers <clears throat> first on both sides. This is Frankie. She's a Merle Great Dane. <clears throat> I'm going to do the floors first. You got butter on your nose. Or the rockers first. And then, uh, two both stand a piece. She's always done that. It's weird. And then I'll do the one floors of my after. Quirks. <laughs> Where's Dan? His costume is that he's a Mopar guy. Yeah, Dodge guy. <laughs> hey, tell him an asshole. <laughs> Whoa! Shots fired. Okay, I'm gonna stay in this for like five more minutes and then I gotta get out. <clears throat> I need my wine and I need my clothes. 
The uh, yeah, there's actually it wasn't too bad at the back of the like the quarter. It wasn't too bad. I could weld there pretty solid, and then at the front where the fender joins, whatever that little brace is, that was still solid. So I joined that, and then up in the door frame. So it's solid. And uh, yeah, so I get those on. So if the doors fit, and if I'm gonna probably take the doors off and brace them up a little bit, <clears throat> the body, and then I'll start chopping the floor. There's not much left of the floor, so I can't see there being much strength left in that. Today was a crazy day. The wind was like unreal. How do you work with all this paper? The wind was like insane. <clears throat> like you can probably hear it, I bet. It's not even that cold, but it's crazy the windy. Wind is nuts. No more truck videos, please. Uh-oh. You got a ways coming. Yeah, the Happy Chevy's had a good one. <laughs> I loved it. Yeah, all new body bushings, too. No filter. I usually don't filter myself. Don't eat the vacuum. Hey, come here. Frankie, come here, honey. Come here. That's a good girl. She have many 55 Chevys. I have one 55 Chevy. Any cool shimming effects for the door gaps? Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping, uh, whatever, I'll just figure it out. But Weld it all up, cut the floors in, be done with it. Be close enough. You can always adjust the doors after, but. It's pretty close. We have his and her tri fives. He's got his 55. I've got my 57. Frankie, don't eat the sandpaper. Are the cowl to floor braces good? Yep. Aw, that sucks, Ozman. Migraines are the worst. Have a good sleep. Hey, oh, everybody. thanks, Chris. Hey. Yeah, doing? this wig is, it's, it's got to come off right away here. I'm going to lose it. Yep, complete floor. I've driven the Cobra once, but I was very scared, and I don't know how to drive standard. Yeah, that was the issue. It's just because you couldn't drive stick. Yeah. Trunk floor's not bad. It needs a little bit of patching at the, kind of by the taillights or whatever, but I'll just jam some metal in there and be done with it. Yeah, winter is definitely coming. If it wasn't windy today, actually would have been a nice day. A bunch of the snow uh, melted and... It's neck base, so that's a bummer, man. Loving that color. That's primer. Red oxide, I can keep it that. Oh, a nice romantic evening in there, Jeremy. Him and, the, him and his old lady are watching in bed. Ooh, sounds all right. Yeah, I don't want to overthink it. I'll just jam the floors in and then whatever. I figure I'll tack it all together. Hang the doors again, make sure it all fits with the new bushings and... Petsu! I feel like we haven't seen you in here in a long time, bud. Kentucky, what's happening? Yeah, that's cool, Ozman. No, all good, Ozman. I know the pain of a migraine and it just sucks. Go lie in the dark, put a bag of frozen peas on your head. That usually helps me. <laughs> yeah, I've never done a full floor, much. excited to try it. I've done so many of those stupid little patches and all the braces and all that. John, what kind of advice are you looking for? Well, we got advice. <laughs> Might not be uh, what you want, but we have it. <laughs> Molson, Manitoba. Oof. Where's that? I don't know, but it's a blizzard. <clears throat> Hello. Hello, Michigan snapperhead. <laughs> Robert's mad. Sorry, Robert. Oh, yeah, it's time change tonight. Oh, yes, extra hour. Dig the wig. That's actually mine. She just took it. I took, I uh, cut a chunk of his hair. The problem with the gas cap, I actually have it wood screwed together because it was uh, falling out. You guys got your shirts and stickers? I'm so glad. That's awesome. Yeah, I've basically been collecting Dan's hair for the last five years to make this uh, intricate 
wig. Floor Jane hair. Yeah. It probably could have. <laughs> every every score buddy should have a 44. I was driving that thing like crazy. I love that truck. Waiting on trick or treaters with the garage door open. Wow. Must be nice weather there. Well, that was a little bit of a jerk comment there, John. You can go away. What do you say? He liked my fat suit costume. <laughs> Kick him out, you know. <laughs> you can take off the mask now. <laughs> no, 57's in the driveway. Then turns on the street. First live, right on, man. Or lady. Dana. Tim, what's going on, buddy? I will say, these were not made for, like, boobs and butt. Well, no, they were meant for me. Yeah, they are meant for flat. And long. Flat and long, which I am neither. I am short and stout. <laughs> Oh, I got a night off or what? From just rescuing people? From just being like one of the world's finest heroes? Me come auction. Oh, that'd be cool. Are we going to do blonde jokes tonight? She probably wouldn't get them. What? What? Uh, I don't build model kits. I guess when I was a kid, I probably did, but that's about it. <clears throat> I hand out frozen progies and handfuls of sucked on sunflower seeds. Oh, that's nice of you. Number one, you don't do that. Yeah, I'm excited to get on the 56. The uh, got one rocker done. I'm gonna start working on the other one tomorrow. And Hi, Brian. Probably put a full floor in it next week. Good evening, Diesel. Hopefully. We are from Winnipeg, Manitoba, the Prairies. Hagerstown. Where's that? Oh, Maryland. I see that. Did you decide what style you want to go to 56? Um, <laughs> Thanks, Bandit. <laughs> I'm thinking big steel wheels. <laughs> Thanks, M and D. <laughs> <clears throat> I like them sturdy. Hot hey, rods I'm, and ladies. I'm not sturdy in the slightest. I fall down every day. Yeah, you're very tough. Me. <laughs> Bar stuff. Well, that's awesome. Okay. Um, I got the floor from a local... Uh, you're changing? Yeah, I've had enough of this uh, wig. I want tights and a hoodie. Hey, long hair's a lifestyle, not just for 10 minutes. I can't do it. Later, Rosman. I'll be back. <laughs> I build replica models of vehicles with company logo on. Interested? Yeah, that'd be cool, man. Shoot me an email or Danny an email. Craigers are going 56. Yeah, I got a bunch of uh, steel wheels in the basement I've been saving, which I think I might do. I like these. Uh, I like them just with steel wheels. And I got two hubcaps, I think. Try five hubcaps. And... Uh, I might do that. I also have a set of uh, keystones, which look a little goofy, but they're quite wide for the back. And I'm going to relocate the rear spring so I can jam some big honking tires in the back of this thing. Uh, a lot of my parts, like, I, I just get a lot of the, like, brakes and all that's all rock auto. And then sheet metal's kind of all over the place. There's two local guys I deal with. And, uh... Actually, again, Rock Auto for a lot of things. I found Rock Auto is the cheapest for uh, carpet kits and stuff like that. Favorite car? A Junkie 56 Chevy? No Keystones, come on. Yeah, I don't think I want to go too crazy on this one because ultimately I'm just going to sell it, I think. Shipping's not too bad. You just gotta watch. They're they're expensive on big bulky things, but once you're paying the shipping once, and then you can get a bunch of stuff, the shipping doesn't really change too much. So, do I have a grill? Yeah, the fifty six has a grill. It's missing uh, turn signal stuff. I think. Yeah, Merce, good talk for today. No, everything I buy has a title. It's really not that big of an issue. I've only had a few cars without titles. That's a bit of a process, but... 
Otherwise, not too bad. This super is going pretty good. Uh, you have a dash for the A. I don't have much for the A. Nope. I got to get a dash. I got to get... Uh, yeah, I got to get a dash. I got to get a firewall. Got all sorts of stuff. Give yourself more credit. LS in the 55. There's a... I put an LS in uh, Danny's 57 Chevy. The 454 in the square body we're talking, it's good. I've been, I drove the thing to work yesterday and actually today, the last two days. Put some tires on it. We'll probably put uh, a couple hundred miles on it by now. It's going good. Oh, nice. Uh... <clears throat> uh yeah no we can work some out. i mean i'm selling it i'm trying to make money on it no bones about it i'm not uh i need to make a few dollars and trying to sell a few things come uh spring so i can afford either a down payment on a house or uh try to build a garage yeah that thing burns fuel and it's a pain actually i was driving it and the splitter screwed up for the uh fuel tanks so I'm just running the one tank, and it only holds like you know, 60 or 70 liters, which is not very much fuel for a big block. With rock auto stuff, I always hate, don't get that. I always get uh, brand name stuff. So you got to get, like I always buy like Moog ball joints and all that. If you go with the, the Chinesey cheap stuff, it is junk, like Parts Master. Stuff it lasts a year, then it's junk. The dog down there. Why well, didn't show your alleys? Yeah, that'd be sweet. That wind is nuts. Hey, baby girl. That's a little breeze. Right your there. treat. No, Frankie, look. Right your treat. She's dumb. <laughs> Parts master has good drill bits. Yeah. Uh, the Model A, I don't know. That's that's a ways down the road yet. What I want to do, but I'm thinking flat black or ratty looking. I'm not really too sure. Story of my life. Are those the only two colors that uh, we own? Or flat black or rust color or? We got a bunch of different colors. Like what? The Cobra's red. Yeah. Your color's blue. Yeah. The Nova's yellow. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess so. The That's the wind you're green. hearing, not the heater. <clears throat> yeah, RC cars are a blast. Love 56. Yeah, me too. It's cool. <laughs> like I said, I started working on it. Did I miss anything fun while I was de-damming? Not really. They said a bunch of nice things about you. Aww, how kind. <laughs> Hi, Dina. I haven't started on the floor yet. So far, it's just uh, rusty. Thanks, man. Yeah, I think the 56 will go pretty quick. I'm not too uh, concerned about it. I was, um, I was confused when I got home and there was like a front end in front of, in front of my car. Yeah, I just dragged it over. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's a pain. I was going to call Murr, but I didn't. I took the hood off by myself. I took the front end off by myself. I was just waiting for you to come over, but you weren't here. Pain in the ass. Where was I? Well, you're doing some of this guy. Oh, yeah, I was. I'll send out the A dash to you. That'll be sweet. Wow, it's like shaking the TV. It's so windy. Yeah, it's crazy. So Cheers email, from man, Brandon. With, uh, how much you want for that uh, Model A dash? What rear end are you putting in? Uh, in this one's got a 10 bolt, literally welded to the frame. What engine is going in the 56? I've got a 400 small block with a tunnel ram. What's, what's ghost white? How is that different than just white white? <clears throat> You'll have to ask D-Wayne. Does it mean people can't see you because you're a ghost? 
Yeah, it's invisible Ooh, paint. Gee. See through paint, that's what you're saying. Like Wonder Woman's jet. Like when she's in the bathroom? <laughs> I sold the T. It's a automatic, it's got a Turbo 350. When I read someone's name, I'm gonna pronounce it wrong. <laughs> Needs a four speed to go with the tunnel ramp. I just saw your video come up. I heard, I guess you got a four speed, eh? With two neutrals? They will borrow it from you. <laughs> Kubota Orange. Blah. You know what color? Oh, I don't have any here. I really like his John Deere Blitz Black. I think, I think it might go that color. John Deere has a color that's not green? Yeah, they got Blitz Black, they got John Deere Green, and they got some yellow. Whatever their yellow is. I'm assuming John Deere Yellow? Oh, I have a name though, but I just like the name Blitz Black. Blitz Black! The 47 is Blitz Black. Or it was. Chug the wine. <laughs> it's only 8 o'clock, man. I have a book I'd like to read later. A blower? You send one, I'll put it on. Yeah, Blitz Black that is would super cheap. That would be really cool. The problem with primer, I love primer, don't get me wrong, but uh, everything I have is in primer. I feel like maybe I should just... Frankie, a, what's in your mouth? A little more or less. She got... Is she just, just patrolling the perimeter? Don't drink me! Hey. <laughs> she had a good lick there. <laughs> Come here. If that, that's your style. Yeah, exactly. People are funny. I always try and make me paint stuff. Murr's like that. Well, Maybe Murr, you can paint one, he says. Murr's a paint guy. He likes paint. <laughs> He's such a paint guy. I'm not really a pickup truck guy. You the, have a pickup truck. No, yeah. but like a 567 pickup. I really like them. Uh, I'm not going to lie. I like the way they look. The problem with a uh, two-wheel drive Chevy truck here, two-tone gray and red oxide primer, Oh, Ed, yeah, that's pretty genius right there. Two-tone primer. Oh, that'd be kind of neat. I could combine both of my passions. Yeah. Primer on primer. <laughs> that, he's Double not, prime. Yeah, that beard's got some knowledge in it. <laughs> Bro, I was saying before, Ed just dazzled me. We should write that down. I'll text him when I forget. Um, what was I saying? Uh, For a primer? I don't know. I don't really listen to you. Yeah, those are myself. That's also the problem. <laughs> just, well, just well at least talk. it's on. It's on recording, so we can <laughs> always go back and and see. Ooh, came out hot pink. I'd like that. I like hot pink. Would you rock? And oh, two wheel drive trucks, right? The problem with pink the fifty six pink for Danny. She <gasps> already got her car. That'd be fun. We're selling the 56, but... Uh, Don't do the Prime yeah, if you see, can't JJ's do JJ's got two-wheel drive trucks. The problem here, so uh, we have winter. Little girl! <clears throat> so six months of the year, it's a pain in the ass. And uh, I find a two-wheel drive truck. You can't, I mean, I always lower it, so you can't haul anything in it. They're always, I like short beds, all those sort of things, so they're useless. So it really is just a car. And... Uh, I'd rather have a, a hot rod than a car. I think trucks that you don't toss anything in is fine, but it kind of kills the point. I'd rather drive the Nova or the 55 than a Chevy truck you can't use as a truck, right? That's why I got that square body 4x4. Four four. I think it's great that you younger people like Tri-Fives. I've been playing with them for 50 years. Currently driving a 55 Bel Air two-door hard top on a regular basis. Oh, that's cool. I want a hard top bad next. I'm thinking I might say that even as I say I want to sell this to buy a garage, but maybe I want to sell it for ratty hard top. Oh, building a big block Nova that one person was. That's cool. I will. Thanks, Bandit. Yeah, new puppy's pretty cool. Quit. Quit it. Quit it. <laughs> Said she's trying to eat all of this stuff that you leave around. Oh yeah. She just wants to be healthy. Never like tri fives. What? Oh, happy early birthday, Bill! Enjoy it, my friend. Freaking out on camera. Here. 
El Camino? No. I think the 56, I either want to sell it for cash, trade it for a hard top, or uh, for a station wagon. Dan, define ratty. <laughs> <laughs> Just watch the channel. <laughs> <clears throat> I think everything on the channel is ratty. I like when it's ratty but safe. Good brakes, good suspension, steering, all that. It's like a sleeper ratty. And I'm not a big fan of huge amounts of rust. Yeah, you do. I don't mind when like there's rust in the quarters or the fenders and stuff, but big holes in the floor or I mean, anything structural drives me nuts. What are you eating? Are you fine? Gross. There you go. Thanks. You're welcome. Find a four-door change into one. Yeah, I might do that. I do want to roll back. The problem, it's not even uh, money so much as space. Here, do you want me to fix your hood? There you go. Here you go. <laughs> Ratty, season one till now. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> What's up with the forward? The Model A, I just tossed it in storage. I think I'm going to do the Model A, then I'm going to do the satellite, then we'll start working on the Model A. Unless I find something else yet. Have you sold the Crested Challenger yet? Uh, no. Yeah, postcard is stronger. I just like the way a postcard looks. It's what cold in Canada. Lame. She's like, I came in here. I want to go back home. Come on. Come lay down. No, girl, come lay down. I, I want to try five wagon. I don't think any other wagon's really for me. But I'm just thinking if I could have, like, get this thing so it runs and drives and it's solid and all the rust repairs done, then trade it for a, either a ratty hardtop. There's a guy selling a ratty hardtop right now. Come here, baby. <clears throat> Purgatory, not storage. <laughs> Purgatory. <laughs> hey. That's wrong with hanging stuff on the fence. Hey. I love it. My eight-year-old and I want that 57 so freaking bad. I'm a mechanic by a day. She's really, I thought you said she was going to be tired and sleepy. Well, she ended up sleeping the last minute. said she's being annoying and obnoxious. She's like running full steam. Yeah, we bought every jacket Amazon had for a little dog. She gets very cold. I think that's just... You. No, she gets cold. <clears throat> oh, Woody. That'd be cool. <laughs> Kids. Ugh. Oh. The new Nomad. Did you see Scott's apology? <laughs> right on. Huh? Nomads. I'd love a Nomad. There was actually a guy selling a 56 Nomad that was really, really ratty for... 18 grand or 16 grand not too long ago. So same thing, if I could get this thing running and driving and flip it for a Rowdy Nomad, that would be the ticket. There are dog sweaters. Oh, I might have taken the dog sweaters off Teespring because nobody's buying them except for me. <laughs> yeah, we were just losing money on it. <laughs> Hi. It windy it's crazy there. windy out there. It's like a scene from Twister. Mopars. Everyone gets mad when I do Mopars. Probably because you don't respect them like you should. Yeah. She is getting her second wind, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we do sell uh, hats on a Teespring. She's never been in here. I think I'm wearing one. Yeah. They're approved. Yeah, you have to hit a certain, um... A certain thing on Teespring to unlock certain items, so. That might be why you can't activate them. I think, uh, I kind of want to toss, like, a Ford motor in that Dodge and see what people say. Does the Tri-5 wagon the same to swap doors on as the other ones, or is it a little different? Well, that's a good question. Oh, do you need to go outside? Is that why? I actually don't know. Come here, baby girl. You went to the door. That's a good girl. Okay, we'll go in the backyard. Come on, baby. 
Allie, what's happening? You have patches with your logo. No, we don't have any patches. We just have stickers, I think. A ratty nomad just sold on eBay under eight grand. Yeah, eight grand American though, with time it shipped and all that. It's probably right around the 15 grand here. Fox body. Yeah, I'm not really a Fox body guy. They're cool and all, but I don't know. I don't know anything about them. Rick, what's happening, buddy? Yeah, I think I want to put a different motor in the Dodge just just because everyone's losing their mind. I think it's hilarious. Girl. I'd like if you try a Nova. I have a Nova. Uh, uh, uh. Peter's junk. I just bought it. It's junk. Well, it was on sale, wasn't it? Yeah, it's some <laughs> switches or something there. Oh, you... <laughs> Nope. It oscillates. <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> I'm not that cold yet, so. So far, so good. Maybe the breaker inside blew again. Well, it's awesome we can do that, that one. Oh. <laughs> There's lights. I don't know. Princess Auto fucked me. I threw the box out, too. <sighs> Dog the bounty hunter. I know, I saw that about Sean Connery. Isn't that crazy? Mort, I was dressed up earlier as Dan, but then I was uncomfortable. You can't have two Dan's in the same spot for too much time. It just doesn't fun. work. It's like how you can't look at an eclipse, you know? Frankie, not under the car, please. She's patrolling. Hey, come here. Hey, no, or not. Look at the board, look, 56. Be... Oh, right on. 30 years. <clears throat> I'm taking anything to the drag strip. Um, you know, I don't know. I'm not much of a drag strip guy. I probably should one of these days. There's uh, there's one actually really close to town now, like just a few minutes. And there's one uh, probably about an hour away. The problem with the drag strip is it just takes up so much time. So much of your day. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. I, I guess it all kind of comes and goes, but... I feel like here's the big thing with going to the drag strips. I know myself, I'd get addicted to it. And I'd want to go faster and faster and faster. And I just don't have the patience <clears throat> to work on one car till it's absolutely perfect. Split by Rick Barrow. I drive one of those, yeah. No, Frankie, don't do that. Do you know Vice Grip Garage? Uh, not personally. Frankie, don't lick that. Come on. It's just a little dirt. Don't you that either. Come on, baby girl. Come here. I'm losing your toy. Six in the UK. Wow. I use a Miller welder. I'm pretty good so far. Yeah, no, I get, well, the challenge, like, uh, winter happened fast this year. Very quickly. I'm not going to lie, it, uh... It was well, like August, and then all of a sudden, just middle of September, it was kind of freezing and all that. And then I wanted to jam on that truck, so I wanted to drive this winter. And how come we don't have music on when working in the garage? I always have music on. We just turn it off when he films. Because copyright doesn't like that. Miller 210. Uh, it's a 215. The multi-process... But honestly, the, the 210 or 211, just the MIG is fine. Spartan the Grease Monkey Tuxedo. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so like, uh, see, yeah, that's the other thing. Uh, when it comes to the drag ship, I think that you always want to go faster, 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 which is one thing. I also, I don't know, I, I think that uh, drag strip videos can be a little boring sometimes. Depending on how it goes. I actually have a plasma cutter, I just never use it. 
ever gonna have a meet and greet? <laughs> we well, we meet people all the time. We go out, but why don't you sign anything up? I don't think we're that big time. Yeah. Who's gonna come? Your mom and dad. <laughs> looking for cheap brand of front runners, front running tires. What size are you looking for? Past your bedtime. Later, ba bald Paul. I like that. <laughs> Bye, bald Paul. 165s. That's a small tire. I always run uh, stuff to like 185. 185, 80, 15. So they're like a trailer tire. <laughs> How much snow you guys got? Not much a right now. A bunch of it melted today. It's blowing around. Like last and night. that's actually tomorrow was supposed to be, uh, no. Monday? Tuesday? Yeah. Like plus 10 or something? Because that's really nice. Thanks, Steve. Why are you swallowing? Yeah, it's a 210. There you go. Mandy is your ambition after a long day of work. <laughs> You're big enough, other big name posers. <laughs> okay. I don't think anyone copied us. We just do our own thing. We just like to have fun here. Stay in our own lane. Oh, she fell. Our own lane of dogs, Coca-Cola, wine, and junk. A live build. Aren't, aren't all the builds live? Like live at SEMA, like chip boots? Oh. We could just show up and start doing it. <sighs> Happy Halloween, Desert Rat, rat Racing. <clears throat> yep, yeah, 400's going into 56. Today, at least. We'll see what happens tomorrow. <laughs> that could all change. I think I'm going to put it in there just for myself, but when I sell it, I'd like to keep that motor, so I'll definitely ask two prices, one with a regular motor and one with the tunnel ramp small block. Like oh, Glutton, I did. Mm -hmm. Thank you for all your help with that, man. I did finally figure it out. What size sort of shoes do you guys wear? I'm like an 8. You're like an 11? Uh, 13? 13. I always get it wrong. Yep. <clears throat> the <laughs> Iron Worker. 2E. I need a new set of boots. These are hammered. <laughs> Original 235 coming up 56, that'd be cool. Are we still house hunting? Uh, I just sent a warehouse to Mike to see if you want to go happers on for 250 grand. In Carmen. You're never going to go out to Carmen. I don't know that. <clears throat> it was giant. For like storage and stuff. Oh yeah. Just because it wouldn't be much more if we split it halfway than what I'm paying in storage as it is. That's true. No car is better than Mopar. <laughs> well, Frankie, what are you eating? I don't think we want to live in the country. That's the problem. Hey, put it. There's actually a really nice house in uh, St. Francis, which I was thinking about maybe going to look at, but it's kind of far away. We're not even in heading one of You know, John, we tried doing a live like that, and it was really difficult because, honestly, Dan just wanted to work. So people were asking questions, and he was answering them, but, like, it wasn't very engaging. Yeah, it's loud. It's very loud, and, like... <laughs> people were complaining. People were complaining. <laughs> so... my full attention. Yeah. They didn't want to just talk to me, which is fair, because what do I know? <laughs> Unless it's a puppy, I don't know anything. Where are you going? Trump wins, might become neighbors. Because he moved to Canada, I guess. Maybe we're forced to the state. Watch out! Oh, you're stuck! Back up! Back up! The 56 just has, I think they're all mismatched steel wheels. Do a burnout again with the truck. I actually did a little burnout today for the video. Danny kind of wussed out on filming. <laughs> oh. It was freezing. And windy. Yeah. You hear that little girl? 
wish we could come up and move to Canada. Well, we wish we, we could move to the States, so. No matter where you are, you want to be somewhere else. <clears throat> the floor pans have the braces with it. Yep. Got yeah, no uh, full pans, braces, the whole deal. Do a burnout in the Kia! The burnout with the truck. Yeah, so I did. They brought the truck today. Brand new tires. Started melting them. Thousand bucks with tires. Woo! We gotta christen them. Gotta wear them in. <laughs> oh, God, everyone's telling me Ohio here. No snow. San Diego. Everyone else is doing it. I don't want to go anywhere crazy uh, with a bunch of people. What's the temperature? It's only it's right it's right at freezing day, but the wind is just howling. No, right in my nose. It's gusting away. You wanna hold it? She's jumping. Yeah, she seems a little squirmy still. <laughs> I like seeing you last. Stay happy. I try. I try. <clears throat> Love YouTube show. Ah, oh, thanks, Morgan. Oh, Danes are the best. We are fans. <laughs> Why the weird questions? <laughs> Shoes, heroes? <laughs> What's wrong with having a hero? <clears throat> like Superman? My hero's Wonder Woman. Bob Superman? Uh, Benjamin, she is a blue Merle Great Dane. I know, that's crazy about John Connery. <laughs> he was 90. He's 90? So, I mean, it sucks when someone dies, but yeah, you get, when you get to be 90, like... He's lived his <clears> life. You're getting up there. I thought that he was younger than that. I guess you never really see him anymore. A Labradane. Oh, and then Waylon Jennings. What's a Labradane? I'm assuming it's a Lab and a Great Dane mix. Yeah, what do you think they look like? Google that shit. Harley Quinn. Aww. Oh. Oregon is way cheaper, yeah. Oh. Red October, yeah, well, he's an old dude, man. Oh, Red October is a great movie. But you gotta think, October. even like in The Rock, he Entrapment, was like 60. yeah, The Rock, that's a good one. You think that, that was in the 90s, eh? The Rock? Yeah. So you gotta think that's like 30 oh, years ago. Oh, Labradane is cute. It's literally like a lab grade day. It just looks like a giant lab. Yeah. That's awesome. Are they crazy though? Yeah, because aren't labs like super energetic? Oh. Yeah, I know. New Mexico, yeah. I could I could definitely deal with New Mexico or Arizona and... Later, Brian. Bye. Do the fifty six same color as your puppy. Oil slick. Thanks, Richard. Yeah, she's pretty cool. Steve's inside right now. Sean Connor is old in the 60s. <laughs> oh, hey, Evan. Welcome here. Yeah, uh, new rockers on there. The only piece of uh, straight, non-rusted metal in the whole car. Well, that's cool. Puptina. That's what she has, is Puptina. <laughs> that's a good one. That's better than the oil slick from last week. She does have Puptina. <laughs> that's very cute. Lowrider, the 56. I got that uh, 47 Chevy. It's a lowrider, and, you know, it's not really for me. I love the way they look, but you really got to be dedicated to be a lowrider guy. And I'm look just... Look at Brian Lawson's wagon. See, that's cool. Like, we need that. That's so cool. His dad's 55 two-door yeah. Candyman delivery. Yeah. But it's got glass, That's what it? they started with. Yeah. See, I like that. Yeah. That's exactly what I want to have. That's cool looking. I think I don't have a four-door, though. I'm not too sure. It would make it in the dogs in and out easier. Yeah. I think, like, you could toss the dogs in the back and... The surfboard on the roof? Uh, no. No quarters. I'm just going to kind of patch them in. Huh. 
We enjoy our Saturday nights with you, too. Aw, that's nice. So speaking of enjoying Saturday nights, I really enjoyed everyone's submissions to uh, the DD Speed Shop Halloween contest. Mm. I had a ripper on Good Laugh at it. Did you? Yeah, they were pretty good. <laughs> so I'm going to announce the winners. Um, so the runner up, so second place, uh, I left quite good at this one. And I think the main reason this one got second place was because the mannerisms were like they had studied you like deeply and the hair was the exact right color. So that one, the runner up is Glutton. So congratulations, our friend. Cause that made me laugh so hard. You get a free so, beer koozie. <laughs> so you pay the uh, shipping. Glutton, send me your uh, um, just text Glutton He's mailing good. stuff. And then the um, first place prize goes to uh, this one. Had me. I think I laughed for about. I didn't even laugh. I cackled at this one for probably half an hour um, straight. So that one is Carmen and her boyfriend who gender swapped and she was you and he was me. And it was absolutely fantastic. So if you guys want to go see the entries for that, um, go to the DD Speed Shop Facebook page. But Carmen, if you're not in the chat tonight, I will send you an email, but congratulations. You have won because that was hilarious. It was so good. good. Everyone's yeah. entries were really good. You guys, you can tell that y'all are fans because you all had very good Dan mannerisms. Is Murr on a quarantine? Yep, he's good. Murr, Murr came out of quarantine and then like the day after we had the like the most cases we've ever had by yeah. like triple. <laughs> so uh, my mom's freaking so we'll see how much I get to see them. Yeah. But thanks everybody for playing our game. It was very, very fun. And congrats, Glutton and Carmen. Where'd you get your sheet metal rockers floors? Yep, all in Winnipeg. Oh, but honorable mention goes to Mr. and Ms. Heavy Chevy. That was my personal favorite. Because yeah. that was very funny as well. Like the Wonder Woman costume, <laughs> her hair. So. I think Mr. Heavy Chevy came up with that scam. I'd love to know just so Miss Heavy Chevy kind of dressed up a little bit. You know crazy. what, though? I bet that they had that planned even before. We said we were going to do a contest. Who knows if those guys? Because, <laughs> like, that was good. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Yep. Challenger shirt is soon. We actually... So uh, soon. Glad you killed it, man. Do you ma The amount of people, everybody at work is making fun of me and stuff. <laughs> My parents. Hey, guys. Just nice July day. <laughs> <laughs> Dan here, yeah. But uh, <laughs> well, the, what was good? He had the point perfect because you don't point you, you this, <laughs> and he had like it was. I swear to God, I was looking at you in the future. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's embarrassing. I don't realize what I do, but whatever. <laughs> but yeah, we got shirts coming. Never seen Mister Heavy Chevy. Oh, he's like Peg, where he doesn't show his face. Yeah, he really doesn't. He's a weirdo that way. But uh, yeah, we got shirts coming. We actually got a Christmas shirt and uh, and, challenger and a shirt. challenger shirt. But I'm a real believer. I don't like I don't like having anything come out before uh, Remembrance Day. No, so it'll come out after. So we'll do after that. I I submitted it, Glutton. I don't. I'm waiting. I'm waiting to hear about it. I submitted beanies. Good. Can I need a beanie? I know. I need a beanie too. What do you mean? Oh, did I send you that meme there of that thing where it's like, uh, it was like, what I think, what girls think they look like in a beanie. It's like, got like the classic girls, like a beanie, she's just like a knockout. And then like the other pictures, what girls really look like in a beanie. Yeah, they, warm. <laughs> they look like a boy. <laughs> yeah, I absolutely, well, remember that first year we were dating and I still had really short hair and I was doing errands like on Osborne, so I parked my car and was walking mm. everywhere. So I was wearing my beanie and I had like a plaid something and I sent you a picture and you just texted me back being like, uh, did you break up with me for a woman? 
Remembrance Day? Veterans Day? I don't know what you call it there. Yeah, like November 11th. We don't like, we don't do any stuff before then. No, no flex fit hats. Bonjour, Gum Gum. Okay, that video of you playing the piano and stuff made me so happy that day. Remember I showed you? Your energy is like wild and I love it. You got quite the studio there. Yeah, it was so cool. Um, I think the hats are flex fit hats, right? Or no, they're not. We don't nope. have flex fits. We're not cool enough for flex fits. Yeah, I just, I love it when you see, uh, like, I don't care what it is, like, if you're into, uh, like, music or whatever, and you go to someone, like, like, the garage here, there's stuff everywhere, and it's all these tools, you get a lot done. I like when you go to someone's place, and they have, like, 50 guitars on the wall, or they're, like, Keyboard. Their passion, like their passion have, is displayed. Like you know, like when you see like a computer with like four monitors or like all those things, it's like oh, they really, like you're giving her. You're not just doing. You're not calling it in. Yeah. You're actually making it happen. I love that. Most Americans wouldn't got her, eh? What? Oh, for Remembrance Day. Yes, oh. for Veterans Day. Oh, you guys don't call it Remembrance Day? A sure price would be wildly expensive. They're actually really cheap. I wanted to buy one. Are they? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know they were the cheap. The problem with it, well, the shirt press is cheap, but that's one's just do like the sticker, like the shh. Oh. <clears throat> Not the, like a screen printing one. So I mean, that's what Teespring uses. It's like it's still a decent quality. Yeah. But I don't think you're saving a whole lot. Ooh. Oh. Mm. They're actually, because I found a place in the States too. They'll, they'll sell you all the stuff real cheap. You can get a bunch of them. Oh. No, oh, for two fifty, bought his daughter one. It's kind of cool. Yeah, no, they uh, and they sell like just the stuff you can print and all that on a regular printer and all those things. What's your favorite takeout food in Winnipeg? Um, I really like Joey's restaurant, and uh, the keg does takeout now. Gary, what's happening, buddy? Us we are bug lugs. Are, <laughs> us connects are awesome. Gondola, yeah, that's pretty good. I like gondola pizza, but I gotta say, uh, Little never, Pizza Heaven is I've my favorite. I've never had gondola pizza. It's thin crust cut in squares. It's pretty oh. good. I don't really like In-N-Out Burger that much. It was a big problem we had. I love In-N-Out Burger. White Castle, though? Oh, you gotta clean your ears, bro. Are they dirty? No, they're so clean, you gotta clean them. Red top. Never had red top actually. The car is gonna get given away at fifty seven thousand subscribers. We have red not Robin hit that burger. number yet. What's a red robin burger? But we're close to fifty seven thousand. I don't know where we're at right now, but we're getting there. Yeah, fifty seven thousand. We're ready to give it away. Yeah, while well, you were that challenge or something in story. Yeah, whatever, we'll deal with it in the spring or Christmas yeah. or something. I wish we had a Sonic. Never had so Sonic. retro. But that's what you said we didn't know that you didn't like it. So if you had a Sonic, you wouldn't like it. Yeah. We need like a Fat Boy or like whatever. Red Robin is old school. Oh. State Sonic today. Mm. I hate those guys in this stupid Sonic. Oh, see, I think they're funny. No, we don't have Lord Co here. That's not like West or whatever. What? Oh, a part store. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, and you know where else we really like is Popeyes. You love that place. Right? I love Popeyes. Oh. Oh, it's good to see you dogs. too, Tim. Two weeks in a row. Wow. Staying up late for us. <laughs> Sonic hit the Dakotas. How far over, I was talking to Merv about this, I should have Googled it, but you guys all know. So, below us is North Dakota. Does that go over into Saskatchewan? And then does Saskatchewan have another state below it too? And if so, what state is that? <laughs> we could just look it up ourselves on a map. I always forget. Mm. My phone's over there. Yeah. These you know guys what? are all Americans. Chick-fil-A was not that great. I liked it. Ten-year anniversary. Oh, happy anniversary, Etsu. North Shore, 55. 
<laughs> I hope your partner's okay with oh. you spending their 10 year anniversary Thanks, Mike. here. <laughs> He's the president of the Tri Five Club. He says, Oh, take your Tri Fives. Well, thank you. Well, that's high praise. Corner of Montana. Yeah. Well done. Funny story yesterday with this stupid 56. It's a curse. So I had my phone <clears throat> and I had it on the quarter panel. I had the, the deck lit up and uh, the phone had slid down kind of <laughs> where the deck lit is. Well, thanks, buddy. What are you laughing at? Oh, M&D. That's nice. Anyways, I was jacking up <clears throat> the car and the deck lid came down and it went shunk and then popped back up. I'm like, oh, that's weird. Must have been something in there. My phone. Oh, um, M and D. I'm gonna. I'll check the tracking thing because I know we had some Teespring issues, so maybe well, yours got caught US, in there. Right? Yeah, but maybe it just got. Did you do that a few weeks ago, now, eh? Yeah. So I'm wondering if it just got caught in the. That was like. That was when we did our Novas. Oh, aren't you guys scamming the mail to scam the election or something like that? So maybe it's. What is a tripod? Is it a carburetor setup? Tripod. Tripod's like for a camera? Oh, she has a DD Speed Shop shirt waiting for her. She's just not big enough yet. Yeah, Steak and Shake's good, too. What's Steak and Shake? Yeah. That's pretty. It's Steak and Shake. Oh, 10-year business anniversary. <laughs> oh, but also your uh, wedding anniversary on the 2nd of October. That's nice. Now that I think about it. Oh, no. Ed Sue. <laughs> no wonder we haven't seen him. He's been in the doghouse. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was a good time, yeah. <laughs> good night, Doug. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for popping in, buddy. She's just crazy. She's just like yeah. face down. She's burrowing. No, we don't uh, we don't poke it. Poke Swag for dogs, fantastic. That's all Danny. I had little to nothing to do with I made one shirt and that was it. But now I'm just quality control. <laughs> Put a reminder your phone to take your M and D there so make sure his stuff went out or whatever. Yeah, I will. He's in the US though, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. That shouldn't be like, what is going on here, babe? She's one hundred percent asleep, but she's like <laughs> lying on her forehead like a psychopath. <laughs> Sonic's every few blocks in Tulsa. Oh, we should go to Tulsa. Tulsa, Oklahoma. My favorite musical instrument is the ukulele. Nope, you're gonna upset her. I'm just gonna put her. See, so sorry, you made I'm her sorry. upset. She's good now. The floor in the truck is awesome. I was complimenting him on it today. The skin food. <laughs> Montana is the other state. Yeah, that's what Glutton said there, just a corner of Montana. That's what I thought it was. I told Merlin. He looked at me like I was an idiot. Like, oh, Hello, comedy box? I'm pretty sure I know this. Is your garage always heat in the winter, or is it a whole process? It's a whole process. No, it's heated. But it's a process to get it heated. No, I, I think it means do I heat it every time, like every day, and I leave it heated 24 hours a day. I set the thermostat, and that's it. Then just Really? Yeah, there's marks on that thing. Oh. For like overnight. When but I'm it's cold. not like a built in heater. You have, it's all manual. Pretty funny. Well, it's not like it's like the house heater. It's like you gotta, you gotta do it yourself. Like you turn the thermostat on? Like you do in the house? I don't understand the question. <laughs> no, like... It's an electric force to heater. That's the end of it. It just works. Sure. You can turn a knob and it goes on. It's not like there's a process to it. The process is turning the knob on. But now that you mentioned that you do that in the house too. It's it, kind of like a toaster. Yeah. You know, like you put it down, you go, how how dark do you want the toast? That's the exact same setup as the heater. I feel like people aren't going to believe that this is my only glass of wine I've had today. No one's believing that. That's, that's mental. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I'm not here for the technical stuff, okay? <laughs> Cut her off. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
She's tired. Bean. He is holding a dog. DD Grill Shop. <laughs> we should do something like that. Just random. We should just have a bunch of them channels. Ones for grilling, ones for dogs, ones for just stupid stuff. <laughs> See what one people like. Yeah. See what takes off. Put two videos up. Garbage. Cancel it. <laughs> Go home, Danny. You're drunk. No, I am home and I'm not. I like it toasty. Yeah. <laughs> I do like it toasty. DD Dane Shop. Oh, that's a good one. That, that'd be a good shirt. We are Dane people. We are Dane people. Hey, oh, isn't that channel called Queen DD's Beach? You're right. <laughs> My channel is full of whatever I want to put on there. I don't care. <laughs> yeah, it's nice having the 56. It fits in here much nicer. I, uh, ice fishing. Ooh, that's way too cold. I've been, uh, I like ice fishing. Last week, I, I got a shed in the backyard that was full of just absolute junk and stuff. And that squirrel was living in there. So I ripped everything out, cleaned it all out. But what else happened with the squirrel? Well, the squirrel ran through there and scared you. <laughs> we were standing there talking, and I was about to leave, and then I turned back to say something. And then all of a sudden, the squirrel, out of nowhere, just ran right past me. And I screamed like I was getting murdered. So I've uh, I moved a bunch of stuff from the garage into the shed. Unfortunately, Hi, Misashi. the backyard is a couple of steps up. So there's a few things I want to put in there. I got a bunch of cylinder heads. I got a few spare transmissions, which I'd like to lug over and put in there. But they're so heavy. Happy Halloween. Yeah, we didn't get, like, any trick-or-treaters or nothing. <laughs> the DD Speed Shop at the Mint, that'd be sweet. Could you imagine? Yeah, I was, I was gonna go take a dolly from work and try it out, but we'll see. Oh, hey, Ken. Welcome to your first live chat. This is all we do. <laughs> is nothing. That dude is so peaceful. <laughs> DD Slobber Shop? Yeah. <laughs> It's 8.30 p.m. People on the West Coast are on their third wine. I see, m and I see. <laughs> I believe it's in the West Coast, but it's warm. Is the West Coast warm? I thought it was just rainy. I threw the kids in the dumpster. Hey, Megs. I love White Castle. What's happening, buddy? Uh, no, his mom actually... Lynn used to have the longest hair. It was like past her butt, and then she cut it all off, which is like wild, but like it looks real good. Man, so windy. We are well, Cyber Weave. How are you? A DD Speed Shop plug gap, but that would be kind of cool actually. Just like a little keychain one. Make that happen. I don't know what that is. What else are you going to write down that we're going to do? Oh, wow. I'm going to check on m and stuff. Oh, there's something else in the game in the chat. Beanies. No. Oh. I don't know. Chocolate milk. That glass hold a liter? I wish. She's more of a gallon girl. <laughs> I can hear the wind. Yeah, it's crazy windy. Hopefully it's blowing in some warm air, though. It's not. What? It's supposed to be nice the next couple days. Is that what happens when the wind no. blows? Is it? Is that why the wind blows? Well, I thought it brought in cold or warm. Is that what they call like warm fronts and cold fronts? I don't know. I'm not a weather metologist. We know. <laughs> she always a glass of wine. <laughs> Later, buddy. Bye. Going dancing. Oh, have fun. Just masked up going dancing. Dog likes her little coat. Remember when you said that all the stuff I got was going to be too big? But it actually just fits perfectly. Yeah, you did a good job. Absolutely nailed it. Yeah. Are you washing all of her stuff or what? Yeah, I gotta put it all in the wash tomorrow. Probably smells like dog. Yeah. Bye, Renegade Garage. Later, buddy. Ooh, from Queensland, Australia. Weather pathologist? Yep, welcome to my life. 
<laughs> Why it comes in boxes? <laughs> Sunny in 20, where's that? Dancing in a mask and hyperventilate. Ugh. Was that Princess Elder Day in my stupid mask? And that toe chain was on sale and this heater, so I was dragging stuff. I'm just like huffing and puffing. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> trying to breathe a little deeper, and the mask just sucked on your face. Like, Hi, Morgan. Oh. Later, buddy. Thanks for popping in, man. Oh, the wheel. <laughs> well, because I'm an angel. Well, in the, you can see, so the, there's that wheel that's back there oh, like, hanging out. Yeah, yeah. And it looks like a halo. It's all painted white from the headers I painted. Yeah. Oh, she just lives here now. Well, she does. We're her owners. We're her humans. We don't just own a slave owner. We're her right? mom and dad. We're just supporting her in her dreams. Wish I could film sitting in that driver's seat. What? Driver's seat. Oh, I couldn't live near a winery, I don't think. No, <laughs> I notice it's crooked. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm not perfect. <laughs> U.S. or Imperial Gallon Van, is there a difference? Whatever's bigger. Yeah, there is. I don't, I don't know it, though. Because we're a Canadian. We like liters. Milliliters. Decaliters. Decals. Decals. You like decals and milliliters, yeah. <laughs> Good night, Joseph. Later, buddy. Well, she had a busy day, this pup. We went to my sister's and played with my nephew. Then we went to and hung out with some of my friends outside, and she was running around. In her defense, she sleeps a lot anyway. Yeah, so. yeah, she does. She spends most of her days sleeping. I took her to work with me on Thursday. Yeah. <clears throat> she slept all day. Didn't leave the office, just slept. Hmm? Decals. Does your gas pump count liters or gallons? Liters. Oh, nice seeing you too. 56 four-door wagon. That'd be cool. Langley. Oh, man. You still have 20 degree weather in Langley? Ugh, that sounds like Oh, hey, John James. Uh, I only have one 10 mil socket. I lose a half inch and 916, so there's no tomorrow. But you can just use 13s for half inch, and honestly, a 14 fits pretty good, so on a 916s. I bet I have 10 half inch like and 916s each sockets. What? I just like hearing you talk about the sockets, and I don't know why. Oh, the sockets like crazy. <laughs> I'm not very organized with my sockets either. I just toss them in the drawer. And get mad if I can't find it. Where are the sockets? Well, and you get mad when I can't find it. Well, you should. And be... I don't even know what it is. <laughs> oh, I know, I know, I know. Do you guys do much recycling, Winnipeg? Uh, I'm not a big believer in it. There's lots of recycling things here, though. Self-taught means does it wrong. Oh, I'm I very I do things wrong all the time. Yeah, fourteen with a hammer, cherry. Yep, hop roll. How long are you on for? Uh, we usually go to about nine, seven thirty till nine our time. So I don't know what that is for you. Mr. Heavy Chevy, you guys killed it. You that guys picture nailed today. it with that picture. That was so funny. It was like every time I looked at it, I saw one more thing. You guys were a solid honorable mention because <laughs> it was good. <laughs> it was good. And I mean, with all due respect, uh, Miss Heavy Chevy was looking good. <laughs> yeah. Um, she reminded me of someone I like. Trashy looked really good on her. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's why they're late to the live stream. Yeah. <laughs> Take the picture, okay? We gotta go do something. <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> Mom, Dad, quiet! <laughs> oh, thanks, Bandit. That's nice of you to say. Craftsman? Honestly, Craftsman uh, screwdrivers were always my favorite. I don't know if they're still the same or not. I know Lowe's has them. I've never, I haven't even been to our Lowe's yet. But... No, I really wanted to go for some reason. You can't say no. 
That's the coronavirus. No, when it first opened, which is like two years ago. Oh. Yeah, they want to go, I guess. <laughs> She's pretty hot. Always was. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about you today. I moved the 55 Chevy off the street in the snow, and I was like, this is in Alabama or whatever. North Carolina or South Carolina. Cold start. <laughs> it was cold. The car did not want to run. Uh, M&D is on uh, the DD Speed Shop Facebook. Or on Miss, or Heavy Chevy's Instagram. Oh, yeah, Instagram. or on Heavy Chevy's Instagram, too. Or ours, and we reposted it, too. Yeah. Because it was funny. They're good guys. I love those guys. This we got to get the damn border open, because I want to go visit some of these people. We want to see people. It's so weird how I feel like we've been pretty tight with... Uh, People we've never really met, you know? It's kind of a weird... It's very strange. The internet's cool. I dig it. Especially because you're like, is it one way? Do we just think we're we're cool? <laughs> I know we're cool. <laughs> we're not very close to New York at all. Aw, thanks, Bandit. <laughs> Danny, you're so nice. Dan's a lucky man. Mr. Trevor, show YouTube. Oh, you did a video on it? I haven't seen that. It, I didn't get a notification for it. Maybe it's tomorrow we start. Oh, oh no. I told Danny, I was like, oh, we should do a video of all these different things and stuff, but then life just happened and we didn't do it. But maybe we should we'll hustle tomorrow and make money. We don't have a whole lot else planned. My workbench is already messy, so I'm basically yeah. heavy Chevy approved. I don't have any diesels or anything like that. We do have a four door 57 Chevy like they do. Yeah. We got a square body truck like they do. Yeah. Ask me if I brought you a sandwich. <laughs> you got a sandwich? No. <laughs> <laughs> Just working on my she shed. Oh, cheers, Darlene. It ain't up yet. Well, I can't wait to watch it. <laughs> we gotta oh, do Rick's something wife tomorrow. is digging the puppy. See, this is how you guys can get all your partners to watch. Is just, but there's a puppy. <laughs> You could do a cross-country tour. I, there's so many people I'd like to meet and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, no. The, we're prepared. She won't be a lap dog for long. That's why we're... You gotta... You gotta do it while you can. Like she's eight weeks old and look how big she is already. It's another two, three weeks and she'll be... Uh, there's no more picking her up. She'll be a full size. I lifted Lenny till he's about 50 pounds. That's when I started getting a little crazy. Yeah. So, halfway there. Sound asleep, yeah. Does that <laughs> dog think she's a cat? Ed, the uh, the dreams this dog has, and she makes she does make those cat noises like she'll be sleeping and she makes these like. Well, she's um, it's like she's eating in her dream or something, so she just. Like a chipmunk, and her tongue's out. Like she's a weirdo. Yeah, she does this thing when she sleeps, where she goes. Yeah. And she just flails around. <laughs> Quester J, what's up? No power. Wee, that sucks. Build a mini tri fi for her. You should ask uh, what's his name how to do it. Fabricator man. Mini Mart. Yeah. Nope, starting the rain. Well, her legs kicking are kicking. Her leg. New York taxi. The uh, buddy of mine wants one of those New York taxis in the worst way. Where a mad call stop me, mate. I have no idea. Yeah, she will be big enough to drive one soon. Yeah, Steve sleeps like that too. Uh, neither of us picks up the puppy poop because I pay for a service. Do your dogs have dreams too, Heavy Chevy? Ah, Alan, thanks for hanging out. First I don't know live what chat. Dream about. Did you hear that? It's Alan's first live chat from PEI. Ooh, lobster. Oh, thanks, Alan. Thanks for popping in, man. Checker, that's what they are, yeah. Most, uh, my buddy Mike wants a checker in the worst way, because they're based on like a G-body chassis or something like that. Wow, good for you, Melissa. Riding her bike and watching. That sounds dangerous. I'm assuming it's a stationary bike. Oh. Hurricane. Canadian made. Bye, company. Teddy. <laughs> Sweet, kind of. Drives me nuts. 
You got a couple of cool dogs, though. They're always in the garage mm -hmm. and stuff. Mm -hmm. These guys don't really like the garage. It's too chilly for them. In the summertime, we spend time out here, though, because we all just sit on in the driveway. Yeah. Yeah, gum gum, all the live drives are done for the day or for the winter year. There's snow and everything. She snores like my wife. <laughs> gray tools are made in Canada. Oh. I have a couple of gray tools, a couple of gray wrenches. Cool hang out with us. Yeah, we're pretty cool. We're all right. This is pretty much all we do, though. Well, honestly, what other options do you guys have right now? <laughs> We're kind of it. So I feel this relationship. What? What other options do you have? If we were allowed out and I had a brand new puppy. I would get someone before you got someone. Yeah, you'd get a lot. Yeah. I'd be pretty good, though. Chevy truck you and a puppy. You don't speak. You don't speak. I have a dog. Yeah, sure. Hi, my name's Dan. I have a puppy. Can I buy you a house? No, that only works on me. <laughs> <laughs> Fireworks. Oh, I love a Willie's Coop. There's so much money. Cyclist runs into parked car. Flames YouTube channel. <laughs> Just like that scene from uh, Wayne's World there, yeah. This flies over. Uh, that one plug life, I watched some of his stuff. He's Canadian, though, I think, eh? Do you have neighbors ever call the city on you? <laughs> yeah, every now and again we've had the city called. Most of our immediate neighbors are pretty amazing. We like them. 257s. Wasn't it around 257s? Doesn't everyone have multiple tripods? Yeah. Bob and Doug McKenzie, other good guys. Warm here in Florida. Yeah, Florida looks pretty sweet. Yeah, the Model A's in storage for right now. Oh, she's dreaming. <laughs> That'd be a cute picture. Well, we do have the dogs. Um, on Teespring, you can get a shop dog shirt um, where it's Steve and um, Lenny driving the 55, and part of those proceeds are all going to community vet outreach. In Lenny's honor. I like to talk cars. <laughs> Me too. You know, I've gotten to a point in my life where if you don't want to talk about cars, I don't want to talk to you. But you talk to me. We talk a lot about cars, though. Yeah. Like, we go out somewhere, and I gotta talk to someone, like... Like, I'm so glad you've done stuff with the ballet and all I think at this point in my life, I wouldn't even be able to talk to them. Did you ever come to stuff at the ballet? Well, I went to a couple things, and it was just, I didn't like it. <laughs> well, I was getting cold here, but I kept going. Took her down, so we'll, we'll do ten more minutes. Oh, you woke her up? I can't reach. Mm. You woke her up. Happy Halloween! That's how I feel most of the time. I just, unless you're going to talk about cars or tractors or trains or something mechanical that has a motor, boats, lawnmowers, it's not about that. I, I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk about the economy or interest rates or the weather. No. All that shit bores me. Let's talk about what hot rod you have, what hot rod you want. Or dogs. You like to talk about dogs. No, I don't like other people's dogs. I like my dog. You know, the other people's dogs are assholes. Is it just me or is that? <laughs> yeah, put scoop on a snowblower. That's what I want to talk about. Yeah, that's what I see about welding right now. Is it gets nice and warm. Wayne, you're starting to ask some weird questions, my friend. Uh, just, you know, keep it cool, bro. Welcome to the midlife. <laughs> I do love when people send me memes all the time of like funny car things. <laughs> like there was that one about you and Princess Otto where it was um it was like the worker Princess Otto and then there's you and it was 
essentially it's supposed to be like you're asking the princess auto guy a question and you're like never mind i'll just go find it myself or something because you know the store better than he does yeah, it's, it's that's true i know like i i'm a better princess auto canadian tire employee home depot employee than most of the employees one of the i remember and i don't know why it impressed me so much because now when i look back on it i'm like i feel like that was a sign like a red flag <laughs> but um when we first started dating and we went to canadian tire because i needed like a couple things or whatever it no no it's canadian tire the one behind the counter no, but oh. that's another story I'll tell too. <laughs> and he, but I needed a couple things for myself here or whatever. And he's like, well, we'll go to Canadian Tire to get them. I'm like, okay, I don't know that they have it there, but sure. Because it was like a lights, like lights or something or whatever. And uh, we go in. I'm like, oh, so I wonder, like, I'm going to go ask somebody where it is. You're like, nope, aisle 34. And then we're going to hit aisle 15. And then from there, we're going to go across the store and we'll go to aisle 12. And you were correct. I know where stuff is in Canadian Tire. Go there a lot. So as well as the Home Depot story. So <laughs> we go to Home Depot and you're buying plywood or something. Is that what it was? It was some kind of wood. I don't know what it was. But, it was something, yeah, it was wood that was by the foot or something like that. But you go, so we're at the cashier and, and the poor young girl is just struggling to find whatever it is in the book. And I don't know why you didn't just take the book, but you decided you should go behind the counter and do it for her. I found what I wanted, scanned it, paid, and we were out of there. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. She wasn't mad at you. <laughs> well, she didn't know. And I mean, they don't blame her. Like, everything's like, whatever it was, you need whatever it is by the foot or a fitting or something like that. They had to find it. Those little I binders. would always make that. I would have to always make the customer just like, what is it? And I'm going on your word because I don't know what any of that is. But you were always too nice. It's like when your purse screwed up there. <sighs> Only six months. Okay. <laughs> I think that was good times. We'll just take this one. <laughs> uh, that's not how that happened either. What? I think that's how it went. No, it was, it'll be six months. And I said, okay. And you, who were not actually paying attention, suddenly goes, no, no, no. We're leaving this store with a purse, whether <laughs> you're exchanging it or I'm just taking it. And I got a brand new coach bag. Yeah. I don't know if we stole it, but you got one. <laughs> Let's admit, they didn't chase us. We didn't run away. <laughs> now we wouldn't be able to do that because I know the manager there. <laughs> we got a better deal. Maybe. Well, that's like, I, I still look at that. When you buy a four or $500 purse, that's like buying a snap-on tool. When it breaks, you get on the truck, you give them the old tool, and you leave with a new tool. There's no, we'll send it in, we'll talk to the manager. No. You bought a snap-on tool, that's what you bought was the warranty. You didn't buy the tool, you bought the warranty. <laughs> Good night, M&D. I'll make sure to check that stuff for you, okay? Later, buddy. We're a mandatory mask here. We have to wear them every time we go out and do anything. That's a maximum of five people gatherings right now. Yep. We're living our dream. Five people and masks everywhere. You can't see anybody. Yeah, sometimes it's nice to be six feet apart. Keeps it alive. Uh... Oh, look at her toenails. She got a couple black ones. Yeah. Seventy six Malibu, eighty five. Oh, that's cool. Is the winner of the fifty seven responsible to rent a snow plow truck to pick up the, the car and access the garage? I think so. Yeah. They made it groups are ten or less. Oh, no, really? not here. It's five. Oh. It's definitely five here. Yeah, I'll email you for sure. I will. Or forget, but we're thinking about you. Later, city truck. Bye. I love old craftsman tools. They are my favorite. <laughs> He's also always been good at social distancing. Oh. I don't like scary shows. No, he They're wouldn't even watch Scream with me. I mean, I also don't like scary shows. I like the idea of them. We do have masks with our logo available on Teespring. Two grand for a big get together. It should be more than two grand. If you're breaking the rules and it actually causes some issues, fine them. Wearing a mask literally hinders nobody, so it's not a big deal to do it. I just want to go for dinner and go see movies again. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care how we got to get there. I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready to go back to the movies. I want 
pissed off I didn't get to see Top Gun this year. Yeah, well, was, Wonder Woman was supposed to come out this month. That was supposed to be my birthday. I was so stoked for Top Gun. Oh, well. Food and cars. Yep, that's basically Yeah, happy right. Halloween to you too, John. Oh, ever watch United by Trucks? Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I like those guys. Give her a kiss on the nose for John. What? That's weird. Can't do it. Look, she's looking for it. A mask improves my looks. I still don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> you should just wear your welding mask out and look real cool. Okay, <gasps> gum gum. That's so funny. I binged Emily in Paris so hard and I loved it. And um, The Queen's Gambit on Netflix is my next watch. Top Gun 2 is so so. Is Top Gun 2 out? No, I think he just found it. I think he found it. On the interwebs. It's out? No. In the internet? Oh. I think it's not out. But sometimes people find these things. Oh, and we don't have those skills. No. Damn it. Stupid. Yeah, see, download movies. <laughs> see you, Navy dude. Fan Tree Rider Project. You know, it would be cool. If you set that up, you let us know when and we'll be there. And we try, like, whenever people send their cars and stuff on the Facebook page, I always try to re I always try to post them so that people can see them. Oh. Lime torrents. 12 volt Dave. Ooh. Your feelings on Corvettes? I'd love to go beat the tar of a new one. Not really for me, though, apparently. Well, Murray keeps telling me I wouldn't fit in an old Corvette. Well, you don't fit in the Cobra, so that checks out. Yeah. I, I'd like a new Corvette. Like, not a... I'd like a... Like the rear-wheel drive. I'm not really an all-wheel drive or whatever their center mount motor thing. They did release Greyhound. What's Greyhound? Yeah, send Look your pictures face. on Facebook. Not you, Dan. Well, I'm not that ugly. <laughs> yeah, she's pretty cute, though, eh? Wow. <laughs> Oh, the breath, though. So bad. Yeah, it's getting better. Cable froze. When do you hook it up with Boosted? I don't know. I talk to that guy almost every day. He's, like, we're pretty far away from each other. It's, like, yeah. 18 hours or something like that. So, but we're just, uh... Her name is Frankie. She's got something in her mouth. In her mouth. You can get it out. Right, right there. Why do you eat garbage? My script garage, Derek, is just south of you guys. Yeah, he's in uh, Minnesota. Minnesota. Greyhound is a Tom Hanks World War II. Movie. Yeah, I like Tom Hanks. Man, that scene where he was in Borat too. Oh yeah, we watched holy, the second Borat. Holy, was that good? <laughs> Would recommend. It was pretty funny. Please didn't care a lot about the mid-engine Corvette either. You know, the problem with the mid-engine stuff and all those exotics, which are all cool and and don't get me wrong, if I had the money, maybe I'd have one. But they're all meant for like high speed and uh, and cornering and braking and all that stuff. I never outgrew just doing burnouts. <laughs> Like, I just love doing burnouts for no reason. Like, a big block Chevy just accomplishes that. You slept pretty hard there. Do you need to go outside? Now we're almost done so, here. 8.59. Well, she's had lots of dog treats today. We go five more minutes and shut her down. Do rocker panel of 56 almost welding? Yep. The, well, this one is welded in. And, uh... I gotta do the other side. This side was worse. The other side should be easier. And there's not much left of the floors. If you guys want to see a bunch of holes, I can show you. Uh, yeah, I have a collab with Waylon coming up. Eventually, when I record my part. That I keep forgetting to do. Start your Fast and Furious franchise with your fleet. <laughs> I always thought that'd be cool, like, if to uh, have, like, a movie car. Like build a movie car or something Good like night, that. Good night, Big W. Later, buddy. Oh, that's a nice bit. 
Leonard thinks. Leonard Taylor. Everyone enjoys a good break, Stan. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think I'll probably sell the 56. Can I dank wear? Dank wear. It's dank. The, uh, I got too many cars. Do you? It's come to me. It's like an epiphany. I need less. I need less cars and more money. Well, I don't like cleaning up the inside mess, Mort. I'm trying to be accommodating, you know? You gotta ask her. She'll let you know. Yeah. Trunk's good. I think he needs a little bit of work. Good night, good. John. <laughs> Excuse me. I like vanilla ice cream. <laughs> yes, she is a soapy eater. That's correct. Actually, I put that DD Speed Shop sticker on it, and it's held pretty well. We really need a new couch. So every time there's a new hole in that couch, I'm just going to put a sticker on it. <laughs> Fixed! That's not, uh... Fixed! <laughs> um, what do you mean that's not? The whole bottom of that couch is zip-tied together. So don't, don't pretend... Well, the problem is, if you get a new couch, the dog's just going to eat it. We keep getting these new puppies. <laughs> that's the problem. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> We need to have a dog that should make it a few months, and then we can buy oh, a new couch. Too soon, man. <laughs> oh, m and I thought you left. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Thank you. Uh. <clears throat> yeah, Challenger, I'm going to sell, and the 56. Well, I say that now, but I don't know what I'm going to... And I also want to, I want to sell the satellite, too. I want to sell everything. Maybe I'll keep one of them or something. But I think if I, yeah. Put a lift kit on the Kia? <laughs> How would I get in? Yeah, I was looking at a rear tank for the K10. That'd be kind of cool. We'll see. I don't know how that all works. You got to do a filler and all that. I like I, that the K10. I like how it's just bone stock. It's so nice. Keep the satellite. Nah. Satellite's a... Whew. Yours that's uh, like 68? Why are you asking me? Oh, I forget. It's hard to keep track of this shit. You have 55 to 67. Sell the Dodge. Yeah, I don't know. Satellite is like gold bars. Well, I, I definitely am not going to give anything away. I want to put it up for real money, and if it goes, then great. If not, I'll keep it. Good night, Alan. I don't even know what the satellite's worth. So it's running and driving, like 15 grand, maybe? Does that sound crazy? Does that sound not crazy enough? Who knows? Yeah, it'll be a running driving car with new floors, new quarters, have all the brakes done. I got a carpet kit for it, a headliner. Seats are ratty, but I don't know. Bugs, I was wearing a costume earlier in the show. But it was annoying me. It was annoying. I could turn a wrench, but never knew which way to turn it. <laughs> I think Robert thinks I'm crazy. 1500 bucks? I don't know. <laughs> I love Command Start. It's a uh, three, well, it was a 318, but it's got a 383 in it now. Actually, did a break job on our Civic last Saturday off of your inspiration to just get the job done. Ooh, a bug visor. Actually, I think I might have got one already. Yeah, I was going to pick up tomorrow, but we'll see. Thanks, man. Yeah, I like new Bronco. Oh, too. I love the new Bronco. They ain't cheap, though. They're not giving those things away. They are not. Uh, Nova's, Nova's in, in storage. storage. Whoa, Jake. Actually, we got to go deal with that. I never unplugged the battery or nothing for it. I'm going to bring it cool. Yeah, you do have to go deal with that. No, it's cold. That seems to always be the, I'm going to do this and this and this and this. And then after it gets freezing, you're like, oh, I should go do those things that I was going to do to prepare for this. <laughs> you know, it's future dance. <laughs> Good night, Bandit. I think we're out of here, too. I just kind of guess with the price and stuff and let her go. I don't, I don't like keeping stuff too long. I'd rather sell it for like a 
a fair price than try and get every last penny out of it. You know what I mean? But <sighs> speedboat, I'd like a boat. Where would we use it? Exactly. Where would we use it? Where would we store it? Where would we build it? All great questions. I don't know. It's future Dan's problem. Yeah. Present Dan needs to buy a boat. <laughs> yeah, I want to go back to the 50s for sure. Hopefully. They open the border, but. All right, we're done here. Sorry, I keep yawning. <laughs> Double din. Uh, yeah, see you later. Bye, friends. Heavy Chevy. <laughs> you guys are great. We'll see you next week. Have a good Halloween, uh, Christmas, whatever. <laughs> Halloween, Christmas. See you later.